four years in a row, the Coastal Chairman went to the conference championship. And just like the Buffalo Bills in the 90s, they lost four in a row. But this year, they're looking to change that. And the fight for a title started this weekend. Being in a wheelchair isn't a disability for this team when it comes to being passionate. Got that now. Go, go. That's you. That's you. That's you. Shot. Anthony Brooks has been playing wheelchair basketball since he was five years old, but it's his first year with the Coastal Chairman. Good job, boys. Yeah. I just love to be um com competitive and uh, yeah, just really stay active. But it's about more than just exercise for Anthony. It's about proving adaptive sports are real sports. Go reach, go reach, go reach. Shots up. Good defense. Good defense. Block that. It means everything because, um, you know, pe people with disabilities, we don't really get a lot in the outside world. So to have this, is, it's uh, real special to us, you know what I mean? One of Anthony's biggest motivators out on the court is his coach and teammate, Jesse Lind. Jesse spearheads a team that's all about positivity, but he also knows he has to push them to be better. I feel like, you know, encouragement is always better than the negativity. So, you know, we always try to gas each other up and gas each other up because mistakes will happen. But, you know, it's how, it's how you uh, react to adversity is what defines you, you know what I mean? Teamwork is the biggest key to success for any season. But just like any other sport, they have to hold each other accountable. What's the point, what's the point of having communication if we're not going to listen? All right, Jose, I want you back in. All right? Come out. But it's all out of love for each other. Oh, it's real fun, you know what I mean? We all just try to be positive, even though sometimes it gets heated. We, we, we just try to stay level-headed and just hype each other up and not be down. Even with a lot of talent on their team, the competition in this league is tough. We got Kobe Bryant out here, bro. I'm telling you, <laughs> Kobe in a wheelchair, dog. But seeing their fans this weekend and the rest of the season will push them to bring home that championship title. One, two, three, champion! Let's go! The disabled community doesn't really get a lot of recognition, so to have all these people come out here, it's, uh, it's special to us, you know? The team got to nationals last year and went two and two, and then finished 10th in the country, but the 2023 season is a chance for even more success. 